Good evening, YouTube. This is Death by Parodies. When Rainbow Falls first came out, I was as excited as everyone else. It was a new episode, a new setting, and we were finally going to see some Equestria Games footage. And of course, it had the glorious return of Derby. Sometime after I had finished, I watched a few of the popular episode reviewers. Much to my surprise, they were all talking about something I had missed. The fact that in Wonderbolt Academy, Snowflake could fly, whereas in this episode, he could not. The worst sin this episode had committed was making the main six, apart from maybe Twilight, act like a generic background idiot, and due to various humorous shenanigans, I can excuse that. If anything, I think making him not be able to fly now adds continuity to his character. I'm glad he can no longer fly, and I'll tell you why. We all know the big joke with him is steroids. The show even hints at him really being kind-hearted, implying he had a past of not being strong at all, weak even, which are the exact kind of people who tend to use steroids. And of course, his physique. I mean, this guy is huge, not natural at all. Okay, so you say he might use steroids. So what? Well, what do steroids do to human adult men? If you don't know, let's just say it causes shrinkage. Maybe Pegasi experienced shrinkage in their wings. Even if you argue that you see no physical difference, I have a theory for that. Going off the almost canon idea that Pegasi use magic in their wings to fly, my theory is the steroids decrease the magic the same way they decrease hormones in human males. I will admit that this whole thing doesn't explain what he was doing there in the first place. Maybe there was an early sign-up sheet back when he actually could fly. Maybe everyone there still thought he would be a beast flyer up until the tryouts, only to find out he could no longer fly, and by then they had already qualified. Anyway, I realize this is all stretching it at best, but that's why they call it Fanon. I hope you all have a nice night, and I wish you farewell.